Some were chasing state titles, others were leaping for them. Cashton's Jack Schleisner was one of them. Schleisner cleared six feet three inches. That was good enough to win the Division Three state title. What, what is it? What is the most exciting thing about competing here at State Track? All the people watching me. That's the most exciting, probably. Why is it exciting? Uh, I don't know. It just pumps my adrenaline, I guess. <laughs> Schleisner was in quite a battle with Wazika Steuben's Lucius Cooley in the high jump. Cooley also cleared 6-3 but had more misses, so he took second. But Cooley was busy elsewhere, taking second in the Division Three 110 hurdles, a time of 14.73 seconds. He also won the 300 hurdles and reached the podium four times today. Elsewhere, Prairie du Chien's Blake Theory took third in the Division Two 110 hurdles, reaching across the finish line with his hand right there. He also took fifth in the 300 hurdles. Logan's Wyatt Peterson was busy today to reaching the podium. Once here in the 100 meter wheelchair, Peterson taking fifth and then sixth in the 400 meters. To the long jump pit now, and that's where Arcadia's Ted Teske was taking flight. Teske soars 21 feet, eight and a half inches to place sixth in Division Two, and a big day at the shot put pit. DeSoto's CJ Millerin letting it fly 51 feet seven and a quarter inches. That was good enough for second place in Division Three. Going in I was first throwing so it was you know kind of difficult getting into it um, but thankfully we made it to the finals which then let me get my form together and throw two over 50.